Hi folks, this is Tarek and Rachel of Tarek Caribbean. Welcome to our second in a series of videos on beachfront condos in Barbados. Yeah, right now we're going to be flying from west to east of the south coast. First up is Palm Beach. Uh, this modern development was built in 2008 and consists of 59 units in two and three bedroom configurations. The square foot ranges between 2200 and just over 2300 square feet. At present, there are no resales available. We just closed our last sale at US 600 per square foot, which rivals West Coast price per square foot. Up next is South Ocean Villas. South Ocean Villas was built in 2006, offering 19 units, all two bedrooms, at 1310 square feet. It's a very popular location. It's right on the boardwalk, uh, close to a lot of the amenities in Hastings. Um, currently, no resales available. Our last recorded sale was at 420 US per square foot. The next development is the residences at Capri. This intimate development features five three bedroom units ranging in size from 2100 square foot to 3100 square feet. This was a record breaker for the South Coast at 800 US per square foot. It's a unique location overlooking Accra Beach. Leith Court, built in 2003, offers 16 units between one and two bedrooms. They're roughly 1,100 square feet. There are currently no resales available in this development, but we're about to close the sale at $432 per square foot. And it has a really cool pool. A cool pool. Crystal Beach, built in 2003, features seven three-bedroom units at 2,500 square foot. These units are spacious and modern, and the design was way before its time. It's very central and has a high walk score. The last sale was in 2014. The Sands, launched in 2015, offers 87 units ranging from studio apartments to five bedrooms. The sizes are 450 square feet up to 1310. The sand sits on just under 2.5 acres of land and is built with the hotel condo concept which offers great amenities on site. Ocean Reef, built in 2010, features 12 two or three bedroom units ranging in size from 1,800 square feet to 1,900 square feet. Another sold out development on the south coast, these units traded at 440 US per square foot. The penthouse was just sold at just under 600 US per square foot. But now at St. Lawrence Beach Apartments. Built in 2006, there are 17 apartments ranging from two to three bedrooms. Square footage roughly 1,600 to 2,600 square feet. There's just four of these units remaining and current list prices are between US 320 to $445 per square foot. Missile Cove, built in 2001, features 14 units, two and three bedroom, ranging in size from approximately 1,500 square foot to 2,200 square foot. There are currently no units remaining, and the last unit sold at 340 US per square foot. We're now at Sapphire Beach. Built in 2009, these 54 units range between two and three bedrooms, and the size is between 1,600 to just over 1,800 square feet. The two most recent sales were between US 530 and 600. The unit that achieved 600 US per square foot was purchased in 2013 at 400 US per square foot. White Sands was built in 2007 and offers 22 units ranging between one and three bedrooms. There are three units available at 400 US per square foot on average. Built in 2011, Ocean 2 features 72 one or two bedroom units. The second phase, which includes the hotel, was just built in 2021. This is another hotel condo concept, and the developers put 10 of the remaining units on the market. There's seven left right now, and there's quite a bit of interest in them. This development also offers some excellent amenities. Ocean One, built in 2007, features 21 units, ranging in size from two to three bedrooms. There have been three recent sales there, and the prices range between 375 US up to 460 per square foot. There's high demand, but only one unit remaining, which is the stunning penthouse, and it's listed at 670 US per square foot. Maxwell Beach Villas was built in 2007 and offers 15 two-bedroom units. There's been a recent flurry of interest in this development, with two units just being agreed for sale. The last list prices were between US 465 and $500 per square foot. Built in 2008, Sandy Hook features 10 three-bedroom apartments. This development is really well for long-term rentals, however, there are no units for sale. Being built over three phases, the Crane Private Residences offers units between one and three bedroom in size, and there are 56 of them in total. 
This historic development offers an array of amenities and is loved by both local and foreign purchasers. I know Zen is one of my favorite restaurants on the island. I hope you enjoy your time with us looking at the developments on the South Coast. And if you would like any further information or to find your home on the South, please feel free to reach out to any one of our agents.